Live from Chicago's number one news, ABC 7 Eyewitness News at 11 continues. Right now at 11.30, volunteers reach a milestone in making their suburbs safer. Now, these men have been using their own time to board up abandoned homes in Harvey. And as Christian Picos reports, the project is personal for them. The South Suburban Public Safety Initiative has now boarded up over 300 abandoned homes across Harvey, like this one right here. It's a mission the organizers say began two years ago today and makes Harvey a better and safer place to live. One house at a time. Jason Decker and Alvin Foster board up abandoned Harvey homes. Observing people's complaints about these abandoned properties here in Harvey, uh, being a former board up specialist, I volunteered my, my time and my truck and my tools. If people donated plywood, that I would board them up. Decker, who is running for the District 5 Cook County Commissioner's seat, says this effort is not political, but rather a matter of public safety. They cause fear. Just by knowing that they're wide open, you, you don't know what's going on in there. Kids have gone in here and gotten hurt. Uh, criminals use them for staging, for, for criminal activity. For two years, Decker and Foster have boarded up over 300 homes in the South Suburban community. You have to worry about somebody sleeping in your house next to you in the middle of the night, not knowing what's going on. So it's kind of a great deal to know that these houses are secure. However, the duo says the project was met with some resistance from city officials at the start. When we were at number 78, the city sent a uh, inspector out and said we weren't licensed, we didn't have a permit, we weren't allowed to do this. Decker followed the city's request, but resumed his work, now saying his efforts are protected under Illinois state law. Uh, if a property is abandoned, we have the right, we as citizens have the right to do landscaping, to make it look nice, and we have the right to secure doors and windows with plywood. As Buzz saw Screech, Decker says the efforts are worth it. What I consider a minimal effort has, I mean, affected thousands of residents here in Harvey. I reached out to Harvey city leaders for comments on this initiative and am awaiting a response. Reporting in Harvey, Christian Picos, ABC7 Eyewitness News. And just moments ago, Harvey City leaders issued a statement saying that the city has initiated, initiated an aggressive blight reduction program to address the challenge of abandoned and unsafe structures in the city. And they're asking residents to report unsafe structures.